Hey everybody, it's Baseball, Baseball 435 here, and I'm back with another video, finally. Um, I've been working on, well, this is more of an update video on something I've been working on for about the past three days or so. Um, uh, I made a networked uh, server and client, or clients. Um, the server is multi-threaded, so it can hold up to well, up to as many pl or clients that your computer can hold. But um, I'm going to show you what it does really quick. By the way, this computer is a little slow for this, I don't know why it just is, but um, I just ran the server, it's waiting for the clients, and then, for this. so this client connected from the IP address, which is uh, this computer, the local host, um, my username, I just made this really quick because I don't really care about how the uh, login works, but um, the reason there's a lot of players there is because the computer's loading, and the way that I have the uh, map being sent over, uh, it's just going to draw a bunch of players on the screen. But I'm going to fix that in the future. But practically, um, this is it. Uh, it's just a person with their name above them, and then a map. Uh, and then you can move the person use the, using the WASD. It's going slow though because of the recorder. But um, practically, the player is sent over the is sent from the server, and it's sent to you. And then the um, client gets it and then draws it to the screen along with their username. So the client doesn't hold any of the important information and can't edit it. So they don't they can't hold the health or the username. They can they can edit the username but it won't edit for everybody else be like client sided. So that's kind of like pointless and yeah. But I'm gonna add in another client. You could do this on two different computers too, or three or however many computers you wanted. But um I'm just gonna run on this one so you guys can see the um difference between them all. But I'm gonna enter username, test test and this is going to get a little bit more laggy so his name shows up and if I move my guy over you can see him but uh wait for this see it's going slow but there we go so let me show you uh when you move this is I'm on the test one by the way when I press S to go down it updates on both of them at the same time it's going kind of slow because of the computer and server but it's almost real time on a good server and um... yeah it, update, it updates automatically everything is uh... sent from the server i had a hard time sending it over the server, sending the players over the server but i got it to work in school today and also got moving to work in school today um... but i've been talking to my friend about this and i really tried yesterday actually i probably put his youtube uh, uh, link in the description. He's got some pretty sweet stuff on there. Or his blog. I'll put his blog in there. But uh, he's got some pretty sweet stuff. You should probably check him out. Um, his blog is Hackniac. That's what it's called. I'll have it in the description. But um, back to my game. Uh, practically, this is it. I mean, you can have as many clients as you want. Uh, so you can. It's really as many as your ser as many as your computer can hold. It's kind of like Minecraft. Like you have a ser you run a server, and then clients connect to it. Stuff like that. Um, Wait for this one. It's gonna get really slow, but uh, let me see. I'm gonna load it up, and I just missed it. Hold on a second. But I can also have a limit. Like I can like set a limit. Um, and then if there we go. And then if it's if there's uh too many players, and it just won't let them in. Um, so I could set it like 4, 2, 16, 500, you know, whatever. doesn't really matter. But uh, there comes test 2. Uh, this is test 2, by the way. I'm thinking about adding the username up into here, or something like that, or somewhere, I don't know. But the next thing I'm going to add in is a chat. That's my main thing that I want to work on. Uh, which one is test 2, actually? This is test. No, this is test 2. So he moves down. It's all automatic practically without the lag. But uh yeah that's where the I'm just gonna exit out and close it. I'm gonna get a bunch of errors on the server because they close the sockets. So I still have to do some error checking as you can see, but it's pretty much finished. I mean that's what I've been working on and the reason I haven't been making those uh game tutorials is because my computer crashed and I was forced to go to Linux. This is actually my brother's computer. But I'm trying to get back to Windows seven uh as soon as I can. But um I'm actually gonna start making those tutorials right after this and then I'll update them or I'll upload them right after it. So um 
yeah, just watch out for them. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Comment, rate, and subscribe.